the class of the field here in the girls 800 meters. That'll bring the boys to the track. And as we reflect back, it was a year after Ephraimson that the boys 800 meters record was set by one Donovan Brazier. One forty-seven fifty-five. that mark. And can we all just say how much we missed Donovan Brazier? Hmm. Yeah, he's a good guy. It was fun to watch him race. Yeah, been battling some, some injuries, the 2019 world champion. And here is a look at the field in this boys high school 800 meters. Now nine men in the field. Originally they had 10, but we had a late scratch. Tyler Matthews of Mesa, Arizona there wearing hip number four. Ethan Walther of Delaware. You mentioned Looking House of Texas, who is back to run here in the high school race. And Trey Sato of Illinois. Clay Shively. Out on the outside wearing hip number nine. Talk about getting close to a sub four minute performance. He ran 4002 in St. Louis. Kansas, multiple state champion of the high school level. We'll keep an eye on him as they get set to race here over 800 meters. Quick out through the first 200 though, Kerry, as they all try to find room to run. And I think in this kind of a windy situation, it is interesting to see who decides to go out into the front. But you said it, they're getting out hard and they're going after those fast times. There's a lot of underclassmen in this race that are the guys to watch. You know, we're looking at juniors, Hilby and Wather taken. And, and I think that it, we're also seeing Lukenhauser, like Lukenhauser, excuse me, see how, how powerful he is over 800 meters as well. So it's fun to see the younger guys going after the older guys. 52-25 for Tyler Matthews after the first 400 meters. That's Hilby of Illinois in second at 52-74. As they head down the back stretch and battle that wind, and Tyler Matthews still with a couple of strides on the rest of the field, but everyone trying to close him out through 600 meters now. Tyler Matthews, six here last year, doesn't want that position again. He's going to have to go here with 100 meters to go. And that is Hilby challenging him on the outside shoulder. Now to the lead as they head into the home stretch. Patrick Hilby, the Illinois 2A champion, but he's not going to be able to hold the lead here all the way to the end as a nice close here by Luckenhaus. And he will take the victory in 147.58 carry, oh. three hundredths of a second off of Brazier's meet record. Oh my goodness, and good thing that, you know, we have him for more years, but he holds the junior record here. And now he's so close to running the high school 800 meter record, but what a close by him. Man, Cooper, Lukenhaus, he just knows how to race. He knows how to time his kick. And in the ninth grade, that's pretty crazy. Yeah, that'll be number seven all time on the high school list. If my quick math does me any credibility or justice, but look at the close that he had here as he moves up and benefits maybe carry from that experience at the junior level here at the PR invite and certainly knows how to celebrate when you win a PR invite race as he did so quite well there as the results here confirmed second best performance and you know you, you saw that distance that Brazier had on the rest of the field when he set